Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, my name is Chelsea. This is Frenchie by Chelsea Elizabeth and in today's video, I'm going to share three of my most unique designer items. So without further ado, let's get this video started. First up, we have these red glitter noir sunglasses from Yumi and I'm obsessed with this pink velvet case. I think it's so special and these sunglasses I got them back in 2012 and I was quite inspired by Madonna to get these sunnies because I saw her wearing them on the red carpet at the Venice Film Festival back in 2011 and she wore them on the red carpet with this beautiful dress and I remember thinking, oh my gosh, these sunglasses are so special and that they are, they are just so different, so unique. They have the gold kind of hardware here and red glitter frames. I mean, they're very different and they're not the kind of sunglasses you're going to wear every day, but for a special event, an outing, whether it's, you know, going to a beautiful outdoor picnic or lunch, or maybe even the races, the spring racing carnival here in Melbourne, you will definitely need a dressy pair of sunglasses like these and they're the kinds of occasions that you could wear them for. So I do love having these sunglasses in my wardrobe. Obviously they're not the most practical investment because I don't wear them every day. You know, they are a bit kind of flashy, but at the same time, you know, it's good to have a pair of sunnies there for those more dressy events. And, you know, these are always there waiting for that perfect moment. And I have worn them over the years to the races. I've worn them, you know, even just on the weekend in the city. And if, you know, my outfit really calls for a dressy pair of sunglasses, these are my go-to pair. So this is the first unique item in my wardrobe. up we have a pair of earrings from Dior and I actually bought these earrings for myself back in 2019 in London for my birthday so that was when I solo traveled to Dublin and to London and you know every time I go overseas I try to buy one really special item to commemorate the trip and I'm so glad that I bought these and the reason that I've included them in today's video is because they are quite different so obviously there are two earrings one is a stud and it has the kind of Dior monogram CD so you can wear that on one ear and then the other side is actually my favorite and the reason that I bought the earrings it's this real statement piece because it sits like it sits like this so this kind of part is actually at the back and you'll see that there are all of these different charms on it so you have like a bee, there's a clover, there's the CD monogram, there's a star, and I just think it's really special and a bit different, a bit unique. And whenever I wear these, I always get so many compliments because they're just they're just a bit different, you know. Obviously, one side is this real statement, and then the other side is just a stud. So if you wanted to even wear your hair on the side, you know, the side that you're trying to accentuate, you definitely want an earring like this. And I just think it's really special. It commemorates my trip. And I've gotten a lot of wear out of these earrings as well, which is actually quite a surprise because, you know, obviously with unique designer items, they're great. They're great to collect, but sometimes you don't get as much wear out of them like the Mew Mew sunglasses. You know, you're not going to wear them every day, but because these are still quite versatile and because I love a good pearl earring look, you can get a lot of wear out of these. They're quite, you know, they're not too flashy. They're just that little bit kind of edgy. So that is the second item on my list. Now the third and final item in today's video is this Marmont mini top handle bag from Gucci that I got for Christmas last year. Santa was very generous and the reason that I've included it in today's video is because it's in white. And I never thought that I would own a white handbag because, you know, you always think about being practical and white's not a very practical color when it comes to bags because, you know, you might get some 
denim rubbing off on it or if you spill something it's pretty dangerous and for someone who's quite clumsy it's probably not the best idea it's not the best investment but that's why it is one of those more unique and fun items that I own I love this because it has the two options you can hold it by the handle or you can use the strap and the strap is kind of half chain half leather so it's a bit different you know it's different to your classic kind of marmont gucci bag and that's why i love this one so much i will say though it's a shame that you know it is hard to keep clean i actually wore a pair of denim jeans and i had to try and kind of use a makeup wipe without alcohol in it to really get rid of the kind of denim that rubbed off on the back here so i mean you can't really tell but it isn't you know in its kind of original condition so that's the only thing that i would say about buying a white handbag be careful especially if you're anything like me i didn't really even think of that that you know my denim would transfer that badly but it really did so that's my only warning to you guys but i just love this bag so much you know it's one of my more unique pieces and again it's quite a statement i think the handle is everything and that's actually why i bought it it also reminds me of the kind of bag that you would wear to you know a beautiful outdoor picnic or you know some kind of luncheon outdoors a garden party a tea party so maybe one day i will have a tea party to wear this too but i have worn it on quite a few occasions and I got it back in December so you know in the past six months I have gotten a lot of wear out of it so in that way you know it has been quite a practical investment it's just more the color that you have to be careful of so that's the third and final item on today's list <music> guys have it i hope you enjoyed today's video leave a comment down below and let me know what you would like to see more of in this kind of more fashion based and style series i'd love to know do you want me to share more about my handbags you know my coats dresses jewelry whatever it is leave a comment down below because i would love to hear from you guys and also comment what is one of your most unique designer pieces i would be really curious to hear from you guys so let's chat in the comments section don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and to click that subscribe button because it really supports frenchy and it helps me kind of know what videos to create more of for you guys too so have a great day and i will speak to you soon bye